fact that it shocked me most is it's already here and that's the main thing that I wanted or we wanted to tell people about that it's already here and we need to do something to stop it. So we came up with some ideas of what they could do as for on the topic of climate change and gave them to the teachers so that they'd have an idea of some of the things that they could get their class to do. And it's not it's not just one day thing, it's gonna be in most lessons for mm -hmm. for a while. Uh, and so using displays, sculptures, music, everything, try and get some sort of so it's to let everybody else know what, what it is we're doing. Hello and welcome to the environmental news. With 1.3 billion people in population, China is one of the most economically affected countries in the world due to climate change. We've now got Ben asking some citizens of China some questions. Does your country agree that climate change is a big problem? Yeah, definitely, because we are one of the richest countries in the world and have 1.3 billion people living in it and we produce a lot of things like I get sent to rich countries and TVs. Um, we can post it on global in like the in and we're just like saying about the increase of the temperature. Um, the flood is what could happen soon if we carry on going because it's New York being flooded by a tidal wave. in two settings, present day 2009 and then in the future 2050. Um, we sort of thought that rising sea levels would cause certain countries like Italy just to become a bunch of dotted islands. Well, my original idea came from thinking about climate change. So I thought about extreme weather conditions, how it affects the people. So we, I looked at Hocker Size, the wave, and it's a scene of a, a tsunami, really, with um, the, the fishermen trying to fight the tide, to fight the waves. So I also thought climate change is very much about the individual doing a little bit that sort of contributes to the bigger picture. We want every promise that's been made to try and come true. Um, I think that they need to set targets, but I know that it's better if they have higher targets of to cut more, but they need to actually stick to them rather than just setting really good targets and never trying to meet them.